the Al Jazeera documentary that exposed syndicates that are behind massive gold smuggling and money laundering in Zimbabwe has aroused interest in the Southern African Development Community SADC, with a government official from Eswatini pulling a SH0 cur leaping to the defense of one of the alleged kingpins. In the documentary titled Gold Mafia, Zimbabwe featured prominently after President Emerson Umnangagwa's ambassador at large Hubert Angel, born Hubert Mudzenayer, was secretly recorded, offering to help undercover Al Jazeera journalists to launder US dollar 1-2 billion in dirty money. Al Jazeera journalists had introduced themselves to Angel as part of Chinese criminals that wanted to clean dirty money through gold smuggling. The documentary also touched on the smuggling of Zimbabwean cigarettes into South Africa and money laundering. In a video that has gone viral on social media, Eswatini government spokesperson Alfias Engzumalo described the expose as a personal vendetta against Angel. Engzumalo claimed there was a plot to smear Mnangagwa's name and scuttle Zimbabwe's investment deals. Of utmost interest and importance in the story that has been developing on Al Jazeera, the journalists behind this story are breaking all norms that govern journalistic ethics, he claimed. They lack understanding that diplomacy is a very difficult job to do which is to navigate around the international system to ensure that the countries they represent get the best in the form of international investors. When you look at the documentary, it is personal to Ambassador Hubert Angel. The documentary is a damp squib, which focuses on someone who is not even a civil servant. Ambassador Angel is allowed to do business and to partner with international observers as they are willingly engaging him within the interest of the people of Zimbabwe. He accused the Al Jazeera journalists of trying to jeopardize the investment and engagement.